Yo, yo, it's Brittany Louise Taylor. What? And I'm gonna show you what's in my makeup bag today because you guys want to see what's in the bag. For starters, my bag is by Eco Tools. My friend gave me a set a couple Christmases ago. It's just it's really cute. I like it. First thing on top is my Larinum foundation. I'm color 2WM. It's their mineral airbrush foundation. And this stuff, my mom actually purchased it and told me about it. It's like, a, like an all natural makeup line. Best foundation ever. It covers really nicely. I'm in love with this stuff. And um, I have my Naked Palette. This is by Urban Decay. As you can tell, Toasted is my favorite color. I'm almost out of it. I usually put that a lot in my like creases or whatnot. But I also use Smog a lot and Sin. Smog, Sin, and Toasted, hey. I have makeup sponges. These are for my Larinum foundation. I have a blush brush for making my cheeks all rosy. I have two used sponges. That <laughs> I didn't do any prep before starting this video. Those will get trash. I have a hair clip because I use that to like take my bangs out of my face when I'm putting on my makeup. So I use this a lot when I'm blow drying or putting on my, my face. I have a hair tie because I probably took down my hair while I was putting on makeup and I just Put it in my bag. I have an eyelash curler. This is by Kevin Kwan. The problem is I need to get a new one of these little insert things. It's kind of like crimping my lashes. I know, bad. I need to get new insert. Kevin Kwan eyelash curler. I have three of my Sally B Get Even and just the powder. It's because I had one and I lost one. So I almost used up this one. So I put the one that was more full in my bag and then I found this one. So now I have three. Powder brush by Jane Iredale for putting on the powder on my face. I have Sugar Bomb and Hervana. I feel bad, like my blushes are getting pretty, ooh. As you can tell they're breaking apart. I use them a lot. I've been, I've noticed that I'm allergic to talc and it's like just not the best thing for your skin. These both have talc in them, but they're beautiful colors, so I'm still using them. Ooh, I have my Christian Dior eyeshadow, 254, blues. Oh, oh yeah, you want it one more time? Yeah. Um, I have my Prestige Liquid Liner in black. I'm wearing it right now. I don't know what I would do without it. It's $6. I have my Larinum Mascara. My mom actually gave this to me. I, I like it, but I haven't used it much. I've been using mostly, where is it? I've been using mostly my Kiss Me Mascara with my Blank Mascara in black. But the Larinum's nice too. It's just a natural, like, you know, has jojoba oil, very moisturizing mascara. Pretty. Pretty Lipsticks by Vapor Organic Beauty. This one's a little bit darker. This is the Siren Bold and there's Siren Ravish. They're ravishing. Ugh, I like them so much. Let me put them back. Sephora Rouge Shine 2010A. And this is just this pink color. It's kind of uh, gropey, gropey, gro not gropey, gross. <laughs> Gropey. Concealer, Smashbox 2.0. It's just their camera ready concealer. I like it. I want to, like, hopefully my skin will calm down enough that I don't have to use concealers, but still I have a few spots that I have to cover up. I Contour Day Balm by Dr. Hauschka. I put it underneath my eyes, a little bit like right here. It's just a moisturizer. Put that on in the morning. Makeup Forever White Eyeliner. Sometimes I'll put it on my waterline to make my eyes look bigger. Favorite Organic Eyeliner. I have two of them. I'm almost done using up this one, and this one's I started using this one, and yeah, I have two of them. I just need to finish using that one up. Duo Eyelash Adhesive. I use that to put on fake lashes sometimes. I'm not very good at it, but I do it. My two favorite paint pots, Rubenesque and Bare Study by MAC. I use this as primer, so that's like in my daily routine. It's usually this with a naked eyeshadow and then some liner and mascara. MAC lipsticks! We got Viva La Glam, Vicky. I honestly haven't worn this color yet. I just bought it because I thought it was pretty. And Morange, it's like Morange. It's like, it's kind of like a pinkish orange. I've worn it a couple times. It looks kind of cool on camera, but I don't really like it in life. Like it's cool on camera, but in life it's just, I don't know. MAC Espresso, I use this to fill in my brows. I have a little girl hair clip. I don't know why. I think I bought them probably for a Molly video on the main channel and I have a hair clip. And I have a bobby pin. <laughs> Again, I don't know how these things get in there. We're gonna rapid fire through these. Okay, okay, eyebrow brush, eyebrow comb, the tweezers. I'm going so rapid right now. MAC brush. Uh, oh, this is by Jane Ardale. It's an eyeshadow brush. Uh, it's a this is a bare minerals brush. Don't really like it. And lastly, Urban Decay 24/7 Gel Eyeliner in Brown. I wear it sometimes. Whoa! And that was what was in my bag. Yay!
I want to know what is one thing in your makeup bag that you can't live without. My one thing that I can't live without is my Larinum foundation. I love it. I already told you why. It's amazing. But yeah, since I found it, changed my life. Let me know! Comment or video response and have an amazing day. And more videos coming soon. And, and, bye!